Welcome back to the internet, my friends and compatriots. Oh, what up, Swole Mike? A.K.A. Rob, A.K.A. Illusion Donate GG. Oh, what up, Swole Mike? We are in the queue for this Legacy Cube draft. And we no longer have... We don't have... We're no longer trophy leaders, unfortunately, because we lost that mono black deck. But we're still on the board. We're still on the board. It's okay. Daddy's on the board still. <laughs> okay. Daddy's on the board still. Mono color, go, <laughs> go, go. Mono is a, an option. Rob, welcome back. Hopefully this headache... I have a real bad headache right now. Hopefully it goes away. Probably from traveling. It probably is from traveling. I'm probably dehydrated. Oh, meatless meat is great. While you were cooling your face down, why not the whole head? Uh, I don't know. I don't really have a way to do the whole head. Is your meatballs from... Is it made out of Beyond, Beyond Meat or whatever it's called? Beyond Meat. Your brains are beyond meat. Oh! Wow. Mono Black? It's a big commitment, dog. Is it? We just got wrecked by the Mono Black deck. It seems really strong. Well, that is a good way to start it off. Guys, are we Mono Blacking? I think we're Mono Blacking. Mono Black. Destroy, destroy the child. <laughs> I not that right Destroy on. the child. Oh, man. I can't even say the other one. I can't even quote the Roseanne one. That's a good one, though. The Roseanne one? Yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> wow. Oh, she older it? Oh, Vraska's Contempt? Ooh. Ooh, ooh, ooh. I think it's got to be Vraska's Contempt, but I hope this she comes back. I thought the deck was white! <laughs> <laughs> oh man good times I think it's gotta be this one Shieldred come on back Shieldred come on back I hope I hope Chad didn't see that one Trojan Rage would get real mad if uh, if he saw me take that Vraska's Contempt over Shieldred was he a big Shieldred fan yeah, it's his boy. It's she's she's his boy. She's his girl. She's his boy. That's what I heard. Obnixilis? Ooh girl. Sword of Fire and Ice seems good in this deck. Yeah, but that's Obby Bobby. Who? Obby Bobby. Hmm. I imagine Ob Read the Bones or Graveyard Marshall will come back. I don't know about Ob coming back. Really? It's a planeswalker. People like planeswalkers. Tell me more about your planeswalker. It's really all there is to tell. Okay. Bobby. Is this not is this not better? Wasn't Lily the better one? No, Lily's not even that great. I think it's sword. Kite sail freebooter. I mean, it's, it has to be that over this if we're mono black. Yeah, it's the only black card. Whatever. You guys think Ob is better than sword? Also, putting a sword on the obliterator is pretty gas. You guys like gas? Have you seen the Game Grumps Do It compilation? Do it. Trainer's Edict? Reasonable. Man Mimic Vat could also be very good. What do you think, man? I really like Mimic Vat. Mim Mimic Vat? Mm -hmm. My only problem right now is that we have Raskus Snap, which kills a guy. You mean Exiles? This actually might come back. Yeah, that's what I meant. Oh, it's your boy. Okay. Well, I mean, there's not really much to c contemplate there. 
there was a sword of light and shadow. We could put Who it on this guy. About that stupid and if we card. have all two swords on it, then then only green can attack. It's your boy. You also Doom Blade, but I think, I think Doom Blades are pretty pretty replaceable. Where this guy is just great, especially if you get Messenger. Blood. Oh, Whip of Erebos. Isn't it Whip? Isn't it always just Whip? Whip is pretty good. Given these guys' lifelink, it's just insane. Yeah, I can see Lily wheeling. I just don't think... I honestly don't think Lily's that great. Like, you rarely... You don't have forms of card advantage, so you don't really want to dis discard cards. You don't have great ways to, to interact with your graveyard. And making them sacrifice is fine, but, I mean, it's not a... It's not an irreplaceable effect in the cube, whereas Obliterator's pretty OP. You just take this. <laughs> or you take Grot. Take Grot the God. Just to hate it. I don't know. It doesn't matter. Relic? Sure. Watch, no black cards are going to come back. Someone else is going to get the signal that Mono Black was open when it's clearly not. It is not. Two drop mana rock. Did you see my Twitter tag? Yes, I did. Nope, this guy came back. I mean, I looked at the list. I don't really see anything that would really apply to me, though. I said, ho, tail, mo, tail, holiday. What's his Twitter tag? What's your Twitter tag? Mbop, sibi, op, bot, do, op, dibi, op, bot, do. Isn't that Hanson's Twitter tag? I stole it. No. And say it again. I'll hit, you, I'll hit you again. Wow. Read the bones, Ob, and the... Uh, like, not one of those black cards came back. That's pretty insane. I guess someone else thought I was open because of Liliana. That doesn't make any sense at all. This guy? Do it again. Don't make me hit you again. I think it's this guy, right? Guy's pretty good. I don't know what do it again means. They will make something apple. What does that even mean? If that's the case, they would have done it before now, right? Might be time to splash. How dare you. Never. Never. Like that? You like that meme? Pretty good meme. Oh, Profane Command. This is a card. Six mana, you get back Phyrexian Obliterator, kill a dude. Yeah. Always Profane. I also want to cut all the black cards that are that are good so that our opponents can't have them. Daddy Cube with the resub. Thanks so much, buddy. Really appreciate it. Welcome back. Man, our deck's only half mono black. It's also half gray. Gray is a part of black. Did you smell that? Did Hunter fart? Did you fart? Did Hunter fart? I want to take the Shriek Maw. Yep. Because there's nothing else there. That guy's like a Doom Blade. You're like a Doom Blade. What are you doing? Touching your coaster? Mm hmm. It's nice and cold.
Dreadshade Rager. It's one of these two, right? It's got to be this guy, right? I think it's Dreadshade, yeah. That guy's just great. Especially if we get... Ya boy. That guy's just grapes. You're just grapes. Wow. I can't believe you. I hate when I miss the misspell thing. Our deck's looking saucy, man. Come on. Mike, my eyes are feeling dry. Can you go get me some more coffee? What does that even mean? Here, I'll help you with your dry eyes. Yeah. God. You gotta wait till he opens his eyes. So then you can get him. But you didn't. Yes, I did. Is this guy castable in our deck? Eventually. Is this guy castable in our deck? Yes. Should I take this guy? I can't pass an Ulamog. I never will. Ulamog you can't pass? Mm -hmm. You're to take the Ulamog. Yeah. That guy just wins. When I was in New York, Elk Tears and LaFeuf brought up this guy. We haven't used that gentleman It's an old while. meme, but it checks out. Heck yeah, it checks out. Don't spray him, you'll forget to cast Rev. <laughs> it's true. Are we dead? What happened? We had Rev in hand. Ooh, Nighthawk. I don't think I care about a Dreader turn. We already have a Whip of Erebos, right? And a Mimic of that. I think we just want... Oh, actually, Nykthos. If that if that Ulmog comes back. Yeah. Is it Nighthawk or Nykthos? I'd probably say Nighthawk. I agree with you. Don't forget, we want creatures that die and trade and go to the graveyard for this Mimic Vat. Abby? Oh, is that your name? Hi, Abby. Hey, I don't know if I love... I just don't like colorless lands, because you want to have, like, double black... Triple black, quadruple black. So, like, the only time you're actually going to want to play a colorless land in this deck is on turn five or greater for optimal curvage. Dark Ritual or Isareth? Uh, Dark Ritual is kind of meh. We're not comboing. Yeah, I want to take the Isareth. What does that card do again? Uh, she's got a 3 3 Death Toucher for three. And whenever it attacks, you may pay X and get a creature back. That has the casting cost to X. Okay. So if you attack with her and you pay five, you can get a Shriek Maw back. Get this guy back. Um, and it, has, it gets a corpse counter so that when it dies, the next time it gets exiled forever. But whatever. What's that noise? What's he doing in there? Breaking stuff. Spectre. It's probably better than Slaughter Pact, right? Yeah. We got another pack after this? My god. Oh my god. I mean, if we're talking about cards that discard, I would love to... I would rather have turn one Hypnotic Spectre than a turn one Liliana. That's one-sided and it's random. Your mom has optimal curvage. Oh, got him. Well, Removing the corpse counter doesn't do anything? That's interesting. It's one of these two, right? I think it's the dame and I can get behind that. That's weird. Like what's the point of it then? Why doesn't it just say if that creature would leave the battlefield exile instead of putting it anywhere else? You don't need the corpse counter. The corpse counter is kind of what has that ability, right? That's super weird. If you remove the counter, it should be just a regular creature. Hmm. That is weird. I'm intrigued. I'll take a Bond Two's Last Reckoning. Or do we want Manic Vandal just in case? What the splash? Yeah, we have Dragon Skull Summit, and red looks like it might be the. I'll just take the Manic Vandal. Oh, and Grath. All right, well. Jesus, the red is real open. Holy smoker, he knows. Wow, okay. Gray Merchant, where are you? 
Oh. Huh. There we go. I was about to take that out of World Connections. Nope. Exactly what we wanted. Eugene! I like Eugene. Do we like it more than Dark Petition or Go for the Throat? I do. I do. Man, there's so many though. I like Overthrow because we just don't have much early game. Fine. Yeah, I think Overthrow is just better. We already have a Karn and we have a Profane Command. We have a lot of things to do. Oh, Bitter Blossom. Is that better than Ultimate Price? We do have a sword to put things on. This is true. Yeah, I'm going to take Bitter Blossom here. Oh, a Murderous Cut. All right. Even better than a go for the throat. I agree with you. Erebos. Or Spellskite. Hmm. I think Erebos is kind of meh. Yeah, but this guy's always going to be a creature, right? Yeah, I guess that's true. Yeah, I think it's Erebos, actually. People ain't got no respect, man. No respect. I don't think we need this. We do have other similar effects like that. We have Whoop of Arabos. We have Acereth. We have Profane Command. I what like about this. Malicious Affliction? And we already have Go for the Throat and Murderous Cut and Shriek Maw. True. And we already... I'd rather have this guy because it's just adding to the uh, Devotion. To the pippage. Oh, we also have Raska's Contempt. Like, we have a lot of removal here. Yeah, I'm going to take this guy. Oh, Mindbender could be great in this deck. Oh, Mindbender, keep on rolling. We can splash the Sphinx and the Nickel Sphinx. The Sphinx and the Nickel Bolas. I'm going to take the Mindbender. It's the obvious choice. But we'd have to, have to figure out what to cut for it. Necrotol? Oh, snap. Oh, this guy's fine. All right, we need three cuts here. What are they going to be? What are we cutting, boys? That is a good question. Graveyard Marshal seems kind of meh. I can see cutting that. He does provide two pips, though. Yeah, but so does this guy. Is Grave Marshal better than Freebooter? No, but I was also thinking of cutting Freebooter. Uh, Descended Mindbreaker is a cast trigger, though, Matthew. So it's not going to actually have the same effect. Two cuts. Is Necrotol better than these other guys? Is Necrotol better than, like, Demon or Erbos? Probably. 
She didn't get any fixing. <laughs> hi -oh. I don't think this cube has enough creatures to really be worried about Desecration Demon. Like, I'd rather just have the 6-6 six -six flying idiot. Uh, it's just a 6-6 six -six flyer for 4 at the beginning of each combat. An opponent may sacrifice a creature. If they do, we tap it and put a counter on it. Is Isarath worth it? Probably. Also just a solid three drop. What is? Isarath. Oh yeah, 100%. Oh, the mannequin came back. That's pretty gas. Yeah, Ice Wrath is totally worth it. It's a 3-3 three, three Death Touch for 3. It kills pretty much everything. It's above average on stats in the curve. It adds 2 pips to the black, and it also lets you get back things like pretty much any creature in your deck. So one cut here. Might be Freebooter. I just don't care about Freebooter that much. Yeah, you can board anyone. It's good. Um... Yeah, 17. I think 17 Swamps is right. Not sure, man. I think you should play one Plains just to get him. Yep, Grave Marshal adds two pips, but it's not great, so. Cut the whip. Are you insane? Yeah, cutting the whip is pretty ridiculous. Whip just giving lifelink is already really oppressive. Yeah, agreed. Uh, keep. Also, Whip with Grey Merchant is pretty busted. For anyone who's played, uh, Theros Limited. Or, not Theros Limited, Theros in general. Keep. Keep on rolling, oh, Mississippi Mike are gonna keep on micing on me. Shut up. Got him. How often can I mic on someone? I mic all day. A smuggler's copter. A bitter blossom. Also known as a smug bug. A smug bug. Mm hmm. Ain't nobody ever called that smug bug. I did. Just now. Smug bug. Do, 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 do. Smug bug. Don't be a Geist of St. Draft. Oh, Jesus. Come on, land. Smugger bug. That's a good draw. Smuggle bug. What I'm not liking to send a mind is that you get to pick what you sacrifice. She put into a mimic vat, which what? Wait, what? Oh, I see what you're saying. Like I could so I could sack a dude specifically to put it in the mimic vat. Yeah, I see what you're saying. I got you, champ. Are smug bugs related in any way to bobbers? Bobbers? No. No, that's ridiculous. As a black deck, I'm really afraid of having to deal with this creature. I guess we got Vraska's Contempt.
they miss a land drop and then discard a planes last turn? That's fascinating to me. Well, that's rude. But they did indeed do that. Oh, that was a good hit. Now we're having a good time. Having a good time. I wonder if we just gone to here. I think we just gone to here. Oh, Metamorph? A hero of Blade Hold. Hmm. Well, shiver me biscuits. Shiver me biscuits. Is there a problem with what I said? No, I just wanted to make sure what you said. I wanted to make sure what you said. Shiver my biscuits every day. Smug bugs are the creatures that reside in Reddit threads and spend their time pissing off everybody else. Yeah, that's pissing on every. Yeah, those are those are some smug bugs. What are you doing, man? Get a bug in here. Maybe. You got is a turkey in your ear? A turkey. A jive turkey. Nibble me biscuit. Gray Merchant is going to trigger for five. That's pretty good at putting us back on the map. Adanto Vanguard. All right, so this is basically mono black versus essentially mono white. Nibble me biscuits. Never. Nibble me biscuits. All right, I guess it's, it's more blue white, but we've only seen literal white cards so far, so. I see. That's going to be a problem. That's really obnoxious. Muggle McBuggles. Oh, you're just going to tap that guy? Alright. Guess you win this round. Yeah, we made it to 500 subs today. So, I guess we're going to, I guess we're going to increase the goal even though it's going to go down real far next month. Oh, good, you're... Yeah, this is just not even fun. Lost 40 subs between Thursday and today, not 80. 80 would be ridiculous. No. How are you doing over there? Beep. Beep, 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 beep. Do you understand? No one understands. Hmm. Opposition is a hell of a card. It's a miserable magic card. <laughs> I 
Oh, the old chub toad flavor text. I liked it better when they didn't have opposition. Me too. I feel like this is a more fun game. Oh, they only get to tap two things down now. That's weird they didn't play anything for five mana. Interesting. If only we had five mana. It costs four, though. You talking about this? Yeah. I actually have no idea what to do here. Miss Fixin, either way, thank you so much for the sub. Really appreciate it. We just have to assume they have like Benzer, right? Or something. Cryptic command. It's definitely getting tapped down. Is it possible we can win this game in any capacity? If he lets us on tap and we get the gray merchant? Yeah, that's pretty good. Oh my god, please do it. <laughs> That'd be such gas. So now they crew when we go three, four, six. Yeah, we're just dead on board because you just had to rest out. Seems good. That seems good. Freebooter seems good. Let's get rid of profane command for now. And McVan, we didn't actually see a ton of creatures that we care about there. Shut up. Hmm. <laughs> uh, what? What? Hmm. What? Hmm. <laughs> <sighs> Hunter, what is your deal, dude? This is actually this into this. Pretty good. That's insane. We are going to be wrecking it. Well, we didn't we didn't see any counter spells, which is nice. Dang it. 
Dang it, why couldn't you be a two drop? I literally boarded in two two drops. Uh-oh, something's happening. Nothing's happening. Okay. Don't counter this. <laughs> Fucking eye roll. <laughs> wow. Solid big fan meme. Yep, so this will never trigger. That is unfortunate. Like you do. Here comes the opposition, you ready? They had to have sensor, spectral, procession, opposition. All right, no, no second blue, which is nice. Come at me, bros. Brewskies. Oh, it's probably just under the wind brisk kites. Never mind. Well, this is definitely not not cube. <laughs> hmm. It's gotta be this guy, right? I hate getting rid of this guy, but He has a pretty good blocker. This guy? Mm hmm. So is this guy. Not in the air. In the air. Who cares about the air? Birds. Birds don't care about anything but your themselves. Hmm. I guess we could just wait a turn to play this guy with. I don't know. Eight hey, mana's a lot. There's Kalidus? Kalidu boy. Well, I guess we're taking a resto. You got three lands in your hand? Oh, I guess we don't get to see the, f the friggin' cards. That's cool. Marsh, Misty, Westvale, I believe. Cool, thanks for not showing me anymore. It's a quality program. Yeah, man, it's got all the bells and whistles. The bees and wheeze? Mm hmm. All right, let's see what this wind brisk heights brings. Nothing. Hmm. So we know they have three lands. They played a Misty. So we know that two of the cards in their hand. Man, this Distended Mind Reader is doing some work, I guess. 
Uh, he can activate Westfell, but it's not going to do anything because you need to sacrifice five creatures. So. Okay, that's fine. Angel is five? We angels in the graveyard. We took the angel in the graveyard because we act, we played Distended Mindbender. We played cards in this matchup. Oh wow, they took our they took our thing. That's fun. Oh, this angel? Yeah, sure. I mean if they want to go all in on that, that's totally fine. Seems like a risky proposition having no no creatures in play. Well, <sighs> unbelievable. Just don't even care anymore. Game one lose the opposition. Game two lose to Armageddon. Fun times, not being able to play any of our spells. Good times. Good times, talking about it. Zip it up, living on a shop. What? Zibazop's living at a shop? Mm-hmm. Just casual Armageddon underneath the wind brisk heights. Super cash. After you copy our whip our whip 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 of Erebos. Whip 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 whip. You think we had a chance? Interesting. I mean we know they had two lands in hand, and they have three damage in the air every turn that's going to gain them three life. I don't know what our chance would have been, but... Yeah, that game did not seem vulnerable to me. Like, how many... Like, we don't have a single card we can cast. Like, if we draw a swamp, I guess we get to kill one 1-1 one, one token. But, like, we have to draw a significant number of lands... Uh, more we have to draw more lands than there are turns left based on three damage a turn. Thanos, have a good afternoon, buddy. Thank you so much for the support. Really appreciate it as always. And uh, this was a ridiculous amount of it. So I hope your your food is the best ever. Just like you. So like, if the cheapest card in our hand costs three mana, we have to draw three three lands, right? And we're gonna take nine damage in between that amount of time. And they're going to gain nine. And, like, then we get to... We just don't have an efficient answer for three one one flyers that have lifelink, like... Sure. I almost had to go watch Netflix. <laughs> My god, I'm so sorry. I never meant to put you through that. Double lifelink. Got him. Gain it twice. The the life's so nice you had Cool. The life's so nice you had to gain it twice. Or not at all. Oh, that's pretty good with Whip of Erebos. Look at this. Look at this combo. Combones connected to the Kasali Pride Mage. This Bitter Blossom is never lasting against the green white deck. Maybe, though. Oh, boy. Oh, that's even better. Kapow. Look at all this lifelink we got here, man. This is why Whip of Erebos is OP. It just puts you back into games. 
where you're, you're where you're real behind. <laughs> I mean, we have w so many ways to kill it. I don't really care, but it's. I just want to finally be attacking with this stupid idiot. Give me a thing. Land. There we go. Shriek it up. Oh, we could also just whip back Necrotol, too. Oh, this is busted. Ooh. Shriek me more. What? Shriek me more. <laughs> I can't not laugh at you saying shriek me more. Were you trying to? I was. I was trying not to laugh at that because... Got him. You did. You, you did got him. Shriek Mama's in the kitchen with onions now. That's true. Oh, God. Oh, I see. You put it back. And I'm just going to... I get to draw it again, though, right? You searched for a resto? And you firebolted Shriekums. I just want to block here, right? Because they don't have anything to resto. Shriekums, me mall. All right. Back again. They're like, I'm going to make sure you never gain any life. Oh, God. Okay, that's fine. Because I kill it. How about a Necrotootles? Necrotootoot. That's good. That's a good one. Shriek me all. Alright, we'll just pass here. Oh, you should have attacked. Why? Because it's going to die at the end of the turn anyway. You could have gained two life. You're right. <sighs> well. Oh my god. All we had to do was keep Raska's Contempt up. Who knew? I certainly didn't. I did not either. Shriek me mum. Might be worth just putting the Mimic Fact down first and just... If they have a removal spell, they're not going to discard a card, so... We're just going to play it first in case they mess up, and then in which case we get to... Oh, they just have Resto, they're just going to block. Seems good. And they just kill us next turn with uh, Kiki Jiki. Oh, kidding. Wow. <laughs> okay, that was actually kind of funny. <laughs> oh, that would have been good. All right, you got me. You got me with that one. Got him. Got him is right. All right, now we just get to ride this hippie to victory. Oh, now I feel so safe. Oh my god, can we get a Grey Merchant under a Mimic Vet? One can dream. Two can dream as well. Any number can dream, Michael. What if they can't? Hmm. Yeah, think about that. God, you're right. I had not considered so that. So dreamist of you? That was pretty dreamist of me. These are not easy to open. With one hand. I don't know, you did it twice in a row. I think it's pretty decent. Dece? Dece. You smell it? 
It smells like poops or farts or something. I'll go look back there and Hunter's going to have pooped on the floor. I don't smell it at all. Well, shriek me mum. Walmart. Oh. 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 It's all happening. Oh, that's gas. D. Atarka. D. D. Atarka. Hey, man, you know about who smelt it, dealt it? I mean, so you dealt it? No, you pooped. No, but you're the one who smelt it. Yeah, but you're the one who pooped. No, that's not how that works. What do you mean? I'm, look, I'm looking at it right now. Is there poop on your screen? B. Aggressive. B. E. Aggressive. Maybe Felipe's. Pooping? Have some poop. Hunter, you need to relax. Unless those are some farts you got going on here. All right, let's see what happens. Is it a resto? It's a sordo. You go poops? You want to see the out see if he goes poop? Sure. He might be farting. He might be farting up a storm. Farting up a storm. Far farting up a storm. Oh, he'll be happy to know there's no poop back here. There's none? No. Oh, thank God. I would like more instant speed removal to be able to deal with the combo, but I think this is a good hand. As long as we can hit lands and instant speed removal, that's all we need to hit. Then we're good to go. Wow, that's aggressive. Nailed it. That was a good hit. Another land would be great, because then we can go uh, Necrotal their guy, whatever they play. And uh, then it died. Oh, wow. The uh, Again, the the great draw of Descended Mind Better into a Dross Messenger, which is a dream we are not able to live, unfortunately. Wow. That's cool. Joke's on them. Had to land the whole time. Oh, they're just keeping this dude? Well, I'll... Did he go? Yeah. Did he poop? Yeah. He did his poops? Yeah. He did his little poops. Hunts, come here, bud. You want to see some hunts? I got you, Jupotion. Come here, bud. Hey. Right in here. Come here. You want to come up here? Come I don't here. know where this came from, but... Come here, hey. Come on. Up here. Hey. Come up here. Oh, there you go. There you go. Look at it. Look at you being a good boy. Come here. Come here. You want to come up here? You want to come Mike's like? Right here. Up here. All right, he's just, he's being pretty ridiculous right now. He's a good boy. He's pretty ridiculous, but he's, he's a good boy. Oh, Splinter Twin. How nice. 
Well, Pretty... that doesn't kill us. Destroys any land? Yes. Oh, that's really good. Yeah, yeah, you're right. If only we had a fourth land, we could kill it. In many ways, but apparently that's too too reasonable, I guess. Chipushi, I wish I could get him to stay longer. He's he's real rambunctious though. He's a high energy boy. Oh, you put a land on top of my library. That's awesome. And you search for what, like a Kiki Jiki, so you can just seal the deal. Yeah, of course you do. Maybe we'll just win with Nighthawk. I mean, it's definitely not impossible. Well, no longer, because now they can just get... Oh, interesting. I mean, Eternal Witness can easily get back Primal Commander Council's Judgment to gain them like a million life. But they didn't do that. Oh, now they can just... They can just copy Eternal Witness forever. Yeah, I'm just done here. This is just not even fun. Yeah, these matches have been pretty fucking miserable, unfortunately. Not a huge fan of losing to opposition followed by land destruction Kiki Jiki combo, but I don't know. I guess that's kind of what you sign up for when you play the mono black deck, but it shouldn't be, I guess, because you have infinite removal. We just didn't really get to draw lands or spells, so. Whatever that means. Oh, losing to Armageddon, that's right. So we lost to Armageddon, Opposition, uh, Kiki Jiki Combo, Land Destruction. Seems good. What will we lose to next? So the amount of time, the amount of games out of four, so f out of uh, four games, four matches, the amount of times we were able to actually tap our lands to produce mana was one. So that's pretty good. That's a good rate. One fourth of the games we got to actually tap. One was one of them where they got destroyed. The other they got destroyed, and then the other was opposition. So, gotta let them rambunct, you know? Yeah. Oh, you're totally right. Rambunked for days. Get bunked on. Get rambunked on. How you doing over there? Yeah, that's what I thought. I'm oh. just gonna leave my face like this. I thought that was how you look normally. Yes. Yes what? Yes. Yes what? Yes. Yes what? Yes what? Maybe. Yes what? Boy. Yes what, boy? I said yes what, maybe boy. Yes what, maybe boy. There's a lot of different directions you can go here. I can play Mimic Vat here. I know I have a creature, so we're going to have to discard something else. Probably the Swamp. But it doesn't do anything on board. If they have an answer for Ice Wrath, it's unfortunate. If not, we can either get back this guy or we can equip this. She's black, so she might be able to survive a little bit better. And I was incorrect because they have Ralz Eric. Because of course they do. Well, this is going smoothly. Guess I should have led with Mimic Vat. What an idiot I am, I guess. Um, it just doesn't do anything. I 
comes the days and we regret not playing the swamp. This is just ridiculous. Like, it's just not even fun at this point. I don't know. Oh, f f congratulations. Yeah, we're just going to the next game again, like you do. All right, bring in Freebooter, bring in Revoker again. Maybe these are just main deckable. Take out the Necrotal, take out Shriek Maw, because we have obviously predominantly black creatures. Let's try it again. Should try again. Should try again. Okay. Colagon's command. Chainer's edict. Let's take that. All right, five cards. So one, two, three, four, five. This is your. This is your hand. Swamp is gone. Sure. Colcon's command. Shoot this guy, make us discard. Alright. Well, that's good. Actually, I guess you could play Ral Zarek if you had a land next turn. I'll risk it. I'll risk it for a biscuit. So I know these are our four cards plus one they drew. This isn't coming into play untapped. Okay, well, they're just showing us everything they draw. I presume you Colagon's command here make us discard something. Next turn you can rouse our kill this guy. We want to keep a land up for this guy. All right, well, 17 lands in the deck. It's pretty uh, pretty reasonable that we keep getting mana screwed here. You're not allowed to have mana in any game. Sorry. Clearly. You're, I'd think you were joking, but nope. All 
Oh, that's good. You made me discard a card when I had more cards in hand to choose from. Play Ralzarek, kill Nighthawk. Or you can just play Chainer's Edict. Thorlik, what's going on, buddy? Glad you can make it live. Unfortunately, you are uh, catching us at one of our more disappointing moments. Okay, this is actually fine, because now we can play Gonti. And if they make a sacrifice something, we can sacrifice Gonti. Oh, boy. I think it's actually Angrath here when they're this low on life. Yeah, that makes sense. Tamio, Force of Will, something else? I think it was just a land. Yeah. Yep. Yeah, don't don't pay double black when you want to play drama. There you go. You figured it out. Also, if they play drama, we can actually steal it. Oh, that. Oh, I see. Liliana. Doesn't that? Did I just kill the Liliana? Yep. <laughs> That's weird. One, two, three, four. We still have two mana left over. We could also play Angrath and plus it, but they have multiple man lands, so I'd rather just keep that up until they can't do anything about it. I, mean, I guess we could have dealt six to the face and then tried to kill them with Angrath next turn. That was also an option. We do have Gary. I mean, our deck. This would have been one, two, three, four, five, six, though. We put, cut them, put up them to two when we know one of the cards in their hand, and then this just deals them two with the plus ability. All right, that's actually probably game. Yeah, you're going to play Drama here. Oh. Not drama. So I can deal you five? Fascinating. I only have to deal you seven. They have to block here, which is great. Yeah, this dude's just lethal all the time now. Florida rain's coming. Here comes Florida rain again. something got him <sighs> did we got him 
we did. Did we? Yeah. <sighs> they have a lot of planeswalkers. You're right. Is this better? It's good. Than what? I don't know, man. Anything. Better than Sword of Fire and Ice, maybe? I think they're, they're blue red, though. Oh, yeah, true. Graveyard Marshal could actually be good here. Just making a bunch of dudes. Yeah, we'll draw it like that. Sure. Hunter's having a bad time. You right. Look, we did it. Oh, let's play that first. Oh, nothing? All right. 2-3 is nice because it gets around Kolagon's command, but it doesn't get around whatever they're going to play right now, unfortunately. Oh, I don't care about that thing. That's a little cutie patootie. All right. That's where they go Liliana to sacrifice it. What are you willing to sacrifice? Not much. I know. Don't think twice. Leave alone with me. Yep, she's going to get a little counter on her. They didn't do anything. That's fascinating to me. Sweat on me, mum. Do you just go for it? That feels real loose. I guess we don't have to. We can just play Obliterator and attack for two. We also have both of these guys on board. Yeah. I am the one. Yeah, I'd rather just put a bunch of dudes on the board. What are we naming here? Probably Angrath. That's the one I'm scared about the most. Which one, though? The Flame Chained, right? I guess I can just look at the one we played last game. Oh, uh, we cast, yeah, the Flame Chained. Okay, we'll name that guy. Play Great Marshal. Because if they tap out for Ralzarek, they can kill one thing. If they play Liliana, they can kill one thing. If they if we go to our turn and they and we try to equip it, they can kill that thing, but then we can put it on something else. So Alright, well that's what they were gonna do then. God, I God I hate calling. It's just too good, really. That's a creature that I'm going to have a hard time dealing with. See if you want to trade me. I think not. Oh, really? Hmm. Fascinating. Fascinating. Wow. 
Wow, it's getting it's getting dark out there, boy. Mm -hmm. Yep, gonna just keep on taking it. Cool. Ooh, not a bad draw. I don't think it's a great draw either, though, unfortunately. We can whip and go for. Well, I'm probably just gonna play Isereth and and go for the throat. Because I'd rather have a creature come back permanently from her next turn than. Uh, there is currently no stipulation. Yeah, because there's no stipulation here. That's why that's an old stipulation. It's actually pretty good. And it's got lifelink. I could have actually just killed Ashiok here, but... Yeah, that was another option. I don't think I want to waste my creatures on that. Predominantly black deck has maybe we've seen maybe like three blue cards. I think both games these are the two blue cards we've seen. Always has it. Yep. Actually, this, I think we might be okay. What don't we want them taking out of the graveyard? Obliterator, perhaps? Jesus Christ, I'm so, Scarab God is the worst, dude. Yeah, that card's pretty, pretty good. So in the future, they can just keep this up in case we whip. Seems good. Yep, and that's the end. Thank you guys so much for watching. Really appreciate it. Slam those like and subscribe buttons and uh, check me out on Patreon and Twitch. Both of those are ways you can support the stream. And I'll see you guys next time.